Hi, so let's look at some organic chemistry functional groups and the polarity of them. So we've got alcohol, we have an aldehyde, we have a um, ketone. Um, what's another functional group? Let's do a ether, a carboxylic acid, a amine, and we can do an amide. They're pretty common ones, and yeah, we'll just compare those ones for this video. So we've got an alcohol, an aldehyde, ketone, so it's a carbonyl in between two carbons. This one's got the hydrogen at the end. We've got an ether, we've got an amine, we've got an amide with the carbonyl and the nitrogen, and we've got a carboxylic acid. So the carboxylic acid is able to hydrogen bond donate and accept. So they, these are very polar. Okay. The alcohol can also donate and accept hydrogen bonds, so it's polar. The aldehyde is accessible. It can accept hydrogen bonds, but it doesn't donate hydrogen bonds. So this is less polar. Your ketone is less polar than your aldehyde because it's hindered by the adjoining carbons, depending on the structure. So there's a lot of other factors. These are just very simple, simple drawings. Um, but the oxygen can accept um, the hydrogen bonds, but it can't donate. The ether, again, is very hindered. It probably wouldn't be able to do anything there. It's, um, it's blocked, so this will be very non-polar. This would be slightly polar. These are very polar. Um, with our nitrogen, nitrogen is fairly available here, so it would be a little bit polar. And with the amide, the lone pair would be tied up into the carbonyl a little bit, so there'd be a bit of delocalization. So this one here would be a um, little bit polar, but not as polar as the amine. Okay, so thinking about the functional groups and thinking about the polarity, think about how big the carbon chain is and how much weight that would have on the polar functional group that you might have within that compound. So putting all that together, you should be able to answer the questions that you may get proposed with about whether or not these are polar compounds. So hopefully this helps you in your polar, non-polar battle. Thank you.